Hello everyone, welcome to the Computer Network Spectacle series. So we'll create a network of one server and two PCs through a switch and show that dynamic addressing. So first of all we select the server and then we select the switch as given and then we have two PCs select the two PCs now of course we need to connect the system so we need connect the system using a copper straight through wire so we select this particular wire and use this fast ethernet and any of the fast ethernet interface of the switch 24 are available we can connect anyone again fast ethernet of PC with any of the fast ethernet of the switch then we connect the server with the switch next we need to configure the server with the IP address so we'll just click on the server and then desktop and IP configure so I will we'll just take this address type the address okay so it is 10.0.0.2 and submit mask will automatically come and default mask is 10.0.0.1 and DNS server is 10.0.0.2 okay. this is auto save now next we need to now enable and set the DHCP service on the server okay so we click on the server again and go to the services tab okay when we click on the service tab we have this many services so we will just click on DHCP and as we can see it is not on so we will turn it on after turning it on now we will uh, write the default gateway is as we know 10.0.0.1 we'll type that address and the DNS server is as we have typed this 10.0.0.2 now you want to type the start IP address so we'll start from 3 because we have already assigned 1 and 2 so we start from 3 and then rest thing will remain same and we just save click on save so now we can see this information this has changed according to what we have set okay. this is what we get now next uh, what we do is we, we need to check the dynamic addressing part so we do what we do is we click on the any of uh, the left most PC okay and then uh, click on the IP address now here we click on DHCP as soon as we click on DHCP it will get the address as we can see 10.0.0.3 then we come to this PC click on desktop icon and then uh, this one so again we click here on DHCP it will automatically fetch the address it will get, get the address from the server that is 10.0.0.4 the subnet mask default everything is there okay now we verify the connectivity by pinging pc1 from pc2 and vice versa we can do both the ways okay so now we are on pc2 so we ping the address of pc1 that is 10.0.0.3 and that's what we are getting the reply okay now we click on the first pc and ping the second one from here so click here on the command prompt and then ping 10.0.0.3 sorry 4 ok what it is so we get the reply ok 10.0.0.4 so that's all for this session thanks for watching